When a sound hits a surface, it bounces back like that? It's like billiards. The angle of reflection equals the angle of incidence. This is termed a specular reflection. At least that models what happens when a sound ray hits a reflective surface that is smooth. When the surface is craggy, like if it has bumps or angles or, or ridges, or pyramids or convex curves, some of the sound diffuses or scatters. And if the surface is much smaller than the wavelength? Low frequencies don't diffuse on small bumps. If the surface is small relative to the wavelength, then the sound will fail to see the bumpiness of the surface at all. The reflection may be specular, or as is so often the case in the modal world of low frequencies, which, remember, means long wavelengths, the behavior may not be easily modeled geometrically.